What's up you guys, welcome back to my channel. So, I don't even know what I'm gonna be calling this video. Okay, so I finally parked, so I hope this is better. I did this type of video last year and basically it's like a new year transformation. So it is a new year, today's January 8th of 2020. So I'm going to start my new year, new me transformation. As you guys can tell, I look pretty rough right now. I have no nails, no lashes, my hair's a mess. I'm a mess. And I just got here to my lash appointment, so I'm not sure if I'm gonna vlog any of that, but I'll show you guys for sure what it looks like when I'm done. Oh my god, my ugly nails. And we're about to go get this fixed. I don't know if I'm gonna like, wax my eyebrows because I want them to kind of get more full. But anyways, this is what the lashes look like. I'm obsessed. Right now, I just got here to the nail salon and I'm gonna get my nails done because this is a mess, it's tragic. I'm back to myself. It feels so good. Like, I hate not having my nails done. I got like a French oval type of deal going on here. Super cute. I'll put like more videos of the nails because I know you can't really tell what they look like right here. Right now, I'm gonna run some errands and then I work later. So, we're gonna continue this video tomorrow and we're gonna continue this 2020 transformation. Okay, so I woke up super early and I was like, you know what, let me go to the gym because I got my gym membership for like the new year or whatever, but I haven't gone not once because I don't want to gym alone and like my schedule doesn't line up with like my friend's schedule. Right now it's my first day going to the gym. I'm so scared, but I guess this would be part of like the new year, new me transformation because this new year I'm going to be fit on that gym life so yeah i'm excited <laughs> i'm gonna try to vlog a little bit but i don't think i will because i'm gonna be like too scared that people are like oh my god she's one of those girls that like records what she does at the gym <laughs> but yeah let's take a moment to talk about my skin because it looks pretty decent my lashes i am obsessed with them Okay, so I don't know if this is gonna be the last time that I show you guys my hair, but this is like my natural hair It's kind of straight. I guess it has some waves in it But yeah, I'm so scared you guys today is the day that I have my hair appointment So yeah, don't mind Lola and my unmade bed in the back Because this is the length that I'm at right now, and I think I'm gonna cut it like right here. Maybe That's so short <laughs> Let's get one last good look at it before I take off and I know you guys might be thinking like why are you freaking out this much it's literally just hair but like I take so much pride in my hair like that's my favorite feature about myself um, I am like a hair fanatic I love everything like hairstyle related hair coloring hair color correcting all that stuff are like celebrity hair artists like Chris Appleton I think that's how you say his name um, like the people that do like Ariana Grande's hair, Kim Kardashian, J Lo, like all that. Like literally, I could watch hair tutorials all day long. Yeah, my point of all that is, I'm nervous because I've had long hair for about four years now, so I don't know anything else. It's not just average long, what people would consider is like long. It's extremely long. That is also why I'm cutting it because as much as I love my long hair, as much as I love how pretty it looks, like when you have it done and everything, it does frustrate the out of me. I'm not even gonna lie. I have headaches all the time and that's because I don't even have like thick hair. I literally, there's times that I sit on my freaking hair because it's so long. Like when I get in my car, I sit on my hair. 
this is like a little too much information but sometimes when I use the restroom my hair will almost like go in the damn toilet thing is it oh shoot which is the one I'm supposed to turn in I have to pick it up or I always have to like hold my hair that sounds insane it's just like too long for me right now I'm also drinking some fancy Voss water you can't even tell so this transformation calls for some water and it's sparkling water too. I don't know if you can see all the bubbles. My hair is like at an awkward point where it's brown and then down here it has like the old blonde that I used to have. Literally it goes from like blonde to like an orange to like blonde. There's some strands that are like at the back that are literally like super blonde. I have so many split ends. Okay, just pray for me. that is this is what it looks like still is like a lot of brown talk about my hair more later on i'm gonna go buy the shampoo go home and i don't know what else okay so this is what i bought at target this one right here you can't even see it it's like the color treated um shampoo conditioner and then the purple shampoo what's up so i got my hair done last week i don't know if i already mentioned this in the previous clips i don't want to be like a full platinum blonde where it looks completely fake where when it grows out my roots are going to be insane i know myself i'm not going to keep up with the maintenance like going every month to dye it or get it retouched or whatever so that's why i don't go completely blonde like would it be fun yes I'm going to put like inspiration pictures of what I initially wanted. So I had set up my appointment. I'm going to link everything like where I went, the girl and everything, their Instagrams down below in the description if you guys are interested in going or you just want to know where I went. So at the salon, she said she was going to do like a blonde balayage on me. And I was like, okay, great. But I showed you guys the first day that I went and process all that, um, the whole thing, you know? And then I showed you the after and... I did like it, loved the length, the color is super pretty, I got so many compliments on my hair but I wasn't like 100% happy with it because there still was a lot of brown on my hair and my hair does grow very quickly like in a couple months it's gonna grow out and it's gonna look like grown out already. Like right here it does look very blonde but then like over here there's still like brown. I just wanted the blonde to go like higher up on the crown of my head. And she was very nice and sweet enough to say like okay i'll help you fix it whatever so right now basically my point of all this rambling is right now i'm going to get it fixed so i'm going to record that too and then show you guys the final final product of what my hair looks like You can see where she did go higher but yeah I love my hair and I feel like so much more confident in myself I'm not saying that you need to like do your hair do your nails do your lashes do all these things to be confident in yourself and be pretty and stuff but my motto this year when you look good you feel good so then you do good period I enjoy watching videos like this, whether they're like 
glow up videos, self care, self pampering type of videos, I watch them. I know I've done one on my channel before. If you guys haven't seen that one, it was my summer glow up one. <laughs> Actually, it was titled something else, but we're not even gonna <laughs> we're not even gonna say. It, but I'm gonna link that in the description. And just like I said, like everything that I've done in this video is for myself. I'm not doing it to impress anyone. This is like getting off topic, but like be kind to other people because. I don't think they were trying to be mean, but several people did like comment to me saying like, oh, you looked better with your longer hair. Oh, you shouldn't have cut it. Like that made me feel kind of weird. But you see, now I'm just rambling because I forgot what my point was and what I was even talking about. This right here is my favorite gloss at the moment from SA Cosmetics. It's in the shade of Spice. Use my code for 10% off. Right now I just got to Forever 21 and part of like, new year new me vibes is getting a new wardrobe you guys already know by now that i have a really bad shopping problem so it seems that forever 21 always has a sale and it's like they're forcing me to shop it's like they want me to shop they want my money so here i am i'm gonna vlog a little bit of that i don't know but i think that's about it so then we're gonna get into the giveaway that i'm doing So here I am with Lola, and then she falls, but yeah, basically this is the quickest clothing haul that you guys are ever going to see on my channel, so just go ahead and enjoy. If we're being honest, this is a mess, like look at how much I'm struggling to even show the clothing on camera, so I apologize for that. These next items aren't even from the same time that I went shopping, but they're too cute that I just had to include them as well. So this is what it looks like in the mirror. It is much shorter. It used to be like right here so i know i never really gave you guys a good like view i guess of what the final product was but this is what it looks like now and then the color okay so i don't know when i'm gonna put this i'm not sure if i'm putting it in the beginning of the video or the end of the video but basically it's giveaway time If y'all are interested in entering my giveaway, then just keep on watching. I'll tell you what's in the giveaway, how to enter, and all that stuff. I know I've been saying that I'm going to do a giveaway. I've been saying that I'm going to do a giveaway since like a little bit before Christmas. That's why there are some like Christmas items in this giveaway, but then that never happened. And then I was like, okay, I'm going to do it for a New Year giveaway, but today's literally already the 18th of January, so it's not like the first few days of 2020 so it can't be a new year giveaway either 
so then I was like okay I'm gonna do it for my 4k subs giveaway so I did hit 4,000 subscribers maybe like a week ago so I was like you know what I'm just gonna have to do it like right now I've been procrastinating this giveaway because I haven't really been filming anything okay so this is my little giveaway basket that I have shoot everything is falling okay, I can't really tilt it because everything is gonna fall so I'm gonna do like an overview of what's in it I was gonna take everything out but that's just too unorganized First thing that I have in this little basket is this gold disposable camera. Then I have this candle right here from Bath and Body Works. It's a really good scent. Then I have this Morphe Beauty Blender. Then over here I have a Kylie lip kit in the shade Mary Jo. Then I have a reusable Starbucks cup, some metal straws to go along with it. Then I have some gel and fuzzy socks. And then back here there's just some more Christmas socks. You can't really see them though. And I think that's it. Okay, also back here I have this lip gloss from my favorite brand at the moment, SA Cosmetics. Use my code for some coin off. And it's my favorite lip gloss in the shade Candy Apple, so you guys will be receiving this as well. Okay, so I know this giveaway is super like girly. Um, so if you're a boy and you want to enter my giveaway, well I'm sorry, like I mean, unless you want this for like your girlfriend, your sister, your mom, whatever, you could still enter my giveaway. So literally all you have to do to enter my giveaway is to be following me on instagram and following my puppy lola on instagram i will be checking those two things so if you're not following my puppy's instagram account or you're not following either of us you can go do that and then just comment down below when you're done or if you already are following us then just comment down below when you're done as well and that's how you'll be entered so once you comment down below like done leave me some little cute emojis something to do super simple to enter my giveaway I've done this before in my first giveaway where if you want an extra like entry i guess you can go ahead and post on any of your social media like stories mostly like instagram i guess or snap and just tag me in it show me that you're subscribed show some love whatever whether if you're watching my video literally it could be anything just tag me you know and that will be an extra entry. I will also be posting about it on my Instagram and then you guys can come watch this video and then you'll know what to do. And yeah, I added a couple more stuff just because hitting 4,000 subscribers is a big deal for me. Like I was so happy when that happened. I was very excited and it gave me like hope for my channel for this new year. So yeah, it's just me saying thank you for all the constant love and support. I think I am putting this in the ending of my vlog, so I think that's gonna be it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed my whole 2020 glow up transformation and this giveaway portion, so thank you guys for watching and just stay tuned for more videos.